Welcome back to Simple Workshop. Today I think we're going to try to do something for Thanksgiving. Perhaps make a little Thanksgiving turkey I've seen on uh, Pinterest. Uh, and we'll give it a shot. A little sucker display type thing. Alright, here's what it looks like. Of course I have no, uh, no measurements or anything so we'll Figure this out and we'll build it together. All right, here you can see I have everything transferred to my wood. My three half circles and my headpiece. So I'm just gonna cut these out. Now I'm done with the saw, I'll just grab my sander here. We're gonna do a little cleaning up by hand. Not too bad. Finish sanding these ones. One, two, three, and a turkey head. How's that look? Pretty good? See, we'll do a little more finishing up here, but first thing I gotta put the holes in for lollipops. Okay, here's my lollipops I'm looking at. Okay, the basics here. I'm gonna try to set this up. Lollipop there, another one behind it there, just like the picture. So, I already know. Another lollipop is see, touching like that. I'm looking at two, one inch in between. So, I'm looking at one inch in between each hole. We'll start out though with a half an inch up because. Well, we'll start with three quarters, that way it stays off the table. Okay, I'm working all these about three quarters of an inch apart, which I've already been doing here. And see, it's how this is three quarter board. I'm going to draw my center lines as well at three eighths of an inch in. I'll set my square three eighths of an inch in and draw my center lines. Like I said, it's in the past. It's all woodworking. If you don't like it, as we go, change it. It's like I thought about the centerpiece here as I marked it out. We can see. I'm going to adjust my holes there to uh, put one hole here in the front, quarter inch in, and then the other hole here in the back, or maybe one on each in case I want to move the suckers forward or backward just to make the feathers look a little fuller because it's in the center one and well, that one may be off just slightly but you never know. Just like that yeah, maybe I'll put double suckers in there just to give it a real full fan. You don't need any fa fancy square. You can go to any hardware store and get a square that'll help you draw lines. They, they can be a dollar a base for all that matters. Even a dollar tree I believe carries them. We're going to use an eighth inch drill bit and go about three quarters deep. Maybe a little deeper in the front one, but we'll see how that one goes. Okay, I have my drill bit. We're going to put a piece of tape on it just so I know I'm not going too deep. Or too shallow, because I do want them to stay all the same. There we go. All you gotta do is remember, we'll start with this one. All you have to do is remember to hold it roughly how you want your, you know, parallel with what you're drawing. Now we got that one drilled. We will sand this off again and get rid of all the marks that are on it. Well, but that's, that's how far my sucker's gonna sit down on the back. Because the other sucker will be in front, actually just like that, off to the side. So, I'm going to continue drilling. Now, I think that looks alright. Alright, clean up, uh, sand, we'll sand this off a little bit and then glue some stuff together.
Remember, always break your edges on the corners so nobody stands a chance on getting a sliver. All right, let's glue this thing together. Okay, I dug out one of my other clamps. I finished sanding that. Kind of like the way that turned out. So we're gonna clamp that together just like that. Whip off all my excess glue. And uh, I'm gonna throw a coat of paint on it, maybe get a couple eyes and something that looks like a beak. And put it right there. Then we'll uh, stack it up and finish this off. Now after I get done painting, I'm going to probably run a drill bit back down through every one of these holes to clear out any paint that pushed in. But this will just be the first coat. I'll probably give it two coats of paint. Alright, we'll let that dry up. Now, show it to you again. Well, and there you have it. Uh, it's been a few days, so we uh, changed up suckers a little bit. But, uh, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, give me the thumbs up and uh, let me know what you think. And I'll see you next time on the Simple Workshop.